Hi Karen, so uh, I'm going to walk you through this uh, video process here and how to combine two clips. So I have my iMovie window open. I'm going to create, or first I'm going to import the movies. So I go to import, I go to movies, and I have two movies on the desktop. So I'm going to create a new event. I'm just going to title it here something, uh, demo. Um, and I will then add one of the movies. So I selected one of the movies and I click import. It's going to go through the import process. Now I see it in there. I see it there as one of my scratch clips. And I'm going to go to file and import the next movie, or the next clip here. So I'm going to select this other clip here. I'm going to make sure I add it to the existing event that I just created. And it's going to go through and import this clip. So now I have both of these clips separate in iMovie. I can see they're both there. I don't know who those people are, by the way. I just downloaded two random clips. So next I'm going to start a new project. I go to File, New Project, and I'm just going to name this again a, a demo project here. Each, uh, of each thing you work on inside of iMovie, you need to create a whole new project for. So I created a whole new project. Now I'm going to select all the content of one of my clips down here in the uh, clip area or the event area, and it's going to load the whole thing up in my project. Next, I'm going to grab the other clip and drag that up to the project window. So now I have both clips side by side. Now at this point, I could export them right here and they'd be next to each other, but we're going to add a little bit here. So I clicked on one of these, I double clicked on one of these events here, and you see these tabs and I can go through and edit the audio. Uh, so I'm going to just do that again on this clip here. I double click the clip and then I get these different additions. I can go through them. I can change the audio. So I'm going to uh, just add volume here and hit done. So now that, that changed the audio on that, uh, that clip. Uh, so we can see I have two clips here and they play next to each other. The next thing I'm going to do is add a transition. So I click the T button. Uh, I'm sorry, not the T button, the, uh, this little icon here. I'm going to add the ripple transition. And I grabbed it and I dragged it in between those two clips. So you can see right there the ripple that's happening amongst them. You can watch. It's kind of quick, but you can see it. Um, so that added a transition. All right, now the next thing I want to do is I want to export it. I want to combine it all together and create one video clip. Um, so the next thing I want to do here is go to Share, Export Movie. I'm just going to leave it as uh, large here. Name it. Uh, remember where you want to save it and hit export. It's going to go through uh, its exporting process depending on how long your clip is. This may take a long time, it may take five minutes, it may take an hour, it really depends. These clips are small so it'll go quick. Um, Alright, so it's all finished up here. I can see on the desktop I have uh, my uh, combined clip. I'm going to open it up with um, QuickTime here. Your clip may open up in iTunes. It, it depends on how you save it but uh, I'm going to open it there, and you can see there's my first clip. Uh, and I drag here, and there's my second clip. And I'm going to go right in between, and I'm going to catch that spot where the ripple was, so you can see the transition. Uh, and there you go. Uh, that is combining the clips. Thanks a lot.